Hey, what's up, YouTube? Leo Shang here, host of the Extreme Fully Fishing Channel. As you guys can see, I am back. But conditions are actually much, much better here today. It's my ninth outing of this year, outing number nine. I'm here at the same place that I was yesterday, the Angling Spear in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Thankfully, today winds are not. 30 miles per hour you know it is in the range of 15 to 20 miles per hour man today was a busy day I took my mom everywhere during daytime you know I told you guys this trip was more about family time you know we went down to the shore we ended up going to the mall you know oh man you you talk about it, you name it you know so now that it is night time it's finally time for us to do some fishing all right i'm gonna be using the same setup that i was using for yesterday however i think that today i'm going to add one more hook to it it's still gonna use pieces of squid same situation we will see if we can catch some more species of fish tonight doesn't matter the size right now i have good news about yesterday our mysterious fish from yesterday that was actually a smallmouth grunt is species number 151 for me new species on the list we will see what happens tonight, you know, hopefully we'll catch a few more, hopefully uh, some exciting catches. Stay tuned and we will find out. So just let me quickly show you guys the rig that I'm using for tonight. It is the same rig that I was using yesterday as a matter of fact. Kinda a high-low rig with two small hooks, as you guys can see, is small size 10 mustad hooks, okay, with the small pieces of squid and i'm using a two ounce sinker all the way down what i'm doing is i'm dropping my line all the way down here right vertical to the pier trying to catch the fish that are hanging around the pier wall i don't know how well you guys can see it right the view is not really good but it is a good five to six feet down there okay so let's get started with the fishing hopefully we are going to catch some fish tonight All right, folks, we got our first fish of the night coming up. Very small fella. But let's see what we got here, huh? Damn, son, what is this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this is a small Tom Tate right here. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah, let's take a photo of this guy and release it. Let's release our first fish of the evening. A small Tom Tate in the Grand family. Check this out, huh? Signature red in its mouth, just like all grunts out there have it, huh? Go back where you belong. All right, come up here. Let's see. Maybe a school of Tom Tate down here. And indeed, it is another Tom Tate. Somehow, they just like this area of the pier. Amazing. I go back to the darkness. Oh yeah, it's on. What we got here? Tom is another one of those. Yeah, it's another Tom Tate. Whole population of Tom Tate here. Son. Oh yeah, come on. Please don't let it be a Tom Tate. Come on, what is this now? Is this a Tom Tate? Please don't tell me this is a Tom Tate. I've been catching too many Tom Tates now. Oh yeah, this is a French Grunch. Species number two of the evening. Hey man, at least it's something different, right? That's a start. Oh, fish on. Do we have anything on? I felt a bite, but I don't feel any fish on. What the heck? Weird. Oh, I think we got something on here. Casting all the way towards the end of the pier, you know? 
Oh yeah, we got something small. What we got here? Little lane snapper on the cut bait. Species number three of the day. Beautiful little lane snapper too. But too small. And I can't use it as cut bait. So taking a photo and going back. Oh, that was a bad release. But hey, that was the third species of the night. That was a bite. Oh, fish on. What we got here? Damn, son. What is this? Wow, that's a grunt for sure. What type of grunt is this? Species number four of the night. Let's check it out. Oh, a sailor's choice. Man, they inhaled that hook too. Check that out. Feisty, you know? Don't want to get hurt by this fish. Yeah, on the squid. Nice sailor's choice grunt right here. All right, let's take a photo, release this guy. No new species for tonight yet. We've been catching the same stuff we have been catching last night. But I gotta tell you something. These sailor choice grunt, they are feisty fish, okay? Very feisty. They fight really well for their size, all right? Now you go back there and grow. Easy, easy now. Did we get it? What the hell is this? This is what it was biting down there, huh? What, what is this? What is this thing here? Oh, this is one of those fish that we caught yesterday. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Dude, this is exactly what I caught yesterday. This is not a tomtage. I'm pretty sure this is called a smallmouth grunt. Check this out, huh? Oh yeah, this is exactly what we caught yesterday, man. Like a repetition. Yeah, five stripes. One, two, three, four, five yellow stripes here. Yellow on the dorsal fin, yellow on the caudal fin. Let me take a proper photo this time. Yeah, this is the same species as yesterday here. I took a nice photo of this fish this time. So now we can properly identify it. I'm pretty sure this is a smallmouth grunt. Same species I caught yesterday. Number 151 for me. I guess they call it a smallmouth grunt because the mouth is small? I don't know, let's double check here. And the, oh, hell yeah, look, the, yeah, the mouth is kind of small, right? And it is red inside, just like a grunt would be. Yeah, all right, good, good stuff, good stuff, you know, nice, nice specimen here. Species number, uh, species number 151 for me, adding to my Pokedex. Go back where you belong now. Sean, come up here, man. You think you can just eat my thing here and uh, <laughs> swim away? Oh, yeah, another species for the night. Little pork fish. Check this out, huh? Damn, son, he is ready to attack me. This pork fish right here. Beautiful, beautiful pork fish. First one of my trip to Florida this time, but I already have this on my species list. So let's take a photo and release this guy you guys see this right here sometimes people here on the channel ask me hey Leo why is it that you squeeze the fish so strong you know because if you don't these things here getting to you you know not to mention that if you don't really squeeze them sometimes they fall on the ground and they end up hurting themselves you know and you definitely don't want that to happen to your catch right so here's our final view of our first pork fish of the evening Bye bye. Not gonna lie, folks, not gonna lie. I am actually pretty excited that we finally got to catch something different than last night. You know what I'm saying? I've been catching a bunch of tom tage, a bunch of different types of grunts, but everything that we really caught last night already. But anyways, the night is still young and we are going to fish a lot tonight. So hopefully we're going to catch some, some more other species out there, okay? Let's hope, let's hope. Oh, okay. He's on what we got here. Wow, small, small, small. Small is not always bad. What is this? Another French grunge? Jeez Louise, these French grunt, man, they like to show up around here. They're beautiful, don't take me wrong, but once you start catching 
lots and lots and lots of them, you know. You don't really want to see them again, and even in terms of micro fishing. You got it, you got it, you got it. Come on. Swallow it, swallow it. Fish on. Fish on. One hound fish coming up right here. Yes, son. No salvation. This one inhaled that piece of squid. Now I got a I got a piece of leader there, so you know. I ain't touching that fish for a little while, you know, feisty one. I gotta use the pliers, take the hook out, take a good shot, and release the guy. Jeez, man, he inhaled. Whoa, 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 whoa. When they say this fish is feisty and he jumps like crazy, I ain't messing around with it. Ooh, shit. Look at those teeth. I am messing around with this fish, man. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Easy, easy, houndfish. Easy, 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 all right? Damn, you really need to take it easy, houndfish. Hooked on the side of the mouth. Check that out, huh? Just gotta hook it real quick here, man. And, uh, you know, take a photo and let it go, seriously. Too dangerous, this fish. I just took the hook out of this houndfish here. I think this fish has suffered enough in our hands. Let's put it back where it belongs, all right? Bye-bye, houndfish. Yeah, that, there you go, there you go, swimming away. Good stuff. Sean, what we got here? Whoa, what is this? Whoa, 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 easy, easy. What is this thing here? This I may not have yet. Whoa, what the hell is this? Okay, okay, very take it very easy now. There seems to be some kind of perch. Some kind of uh, of perch. Does it have teeth? Actually it doesn't have canines here. What the hell is this? Let me let me double check here. Let me double check. Gotta be easy on this fish. Does it have canines here? It doesn't really have canines, right? When I catch a new species, you know, I always get excited. You gotta, you gotta see what is it about. It's got a big mouth, little yellow, yellow tongue. All right, but I, I don't know what this is actually. Very beautiful. Whoa, easy now. Very beautiful. <laughs> Let's take a photo and release this guy. All right, folks. Final view of our mysterious little fish right here all right this is a i think this is a new species for me i'm not sure though very beautiful fish looks like some kind of a uh, perch no canines you know we will see we will see bye bye oh it's on what the heck what is this Oh man, we caught this one yesterday, but not today yet, right? This is what, a white grunge? Is this what it is? White or blue striped? White grunge, there we go. Yeah, little white grunge. Another species yet for the evening. Beautiful fish, beautiful fish. All right, final view of our little white grunge here. Time to release this guy. Oh boy, it's been a good night so far, right folks? quite an assortment of different species of fish we got to see all right right easy easy fish you're going back don't worry about it don't worry about it okay i was saying we got to see three species that we didn't catch yesterday right the pork fish the hound fish and the mysterious fish that i haven't identified yet that's all good let's try to catch some more it's about 12 30 a.m right now you know i gotta fish until about 2 a.m Let's see what else we can catch for tonight. Whoa, okay. That was a quick bite for something so small. <laughs> what the heck is that? Damn, son, a very small white grunge that will be perfect for a fish tank. Check this out. No jokes, huh? My God, all right, oh, come on, come on. Oh yeah, fish on. What is this? Another one of those? Yeah, another one of those, whatever this thing is here. Check this out, huh? we got another sample. 
Man, I have no clue what is this. It looks like an American silver perch. But I'm not entirely sure if this is an American silver perch though. It doesn't have it doesn't have canines, so it is not a sand perch. Here, let me unhook it here real quick. I'm gonna show you guys. If if this fish had canines in front, it would be a seal, uh, it would be you know a sand perch. But see, it doesn't have canines at all. No canines. So this has gotta be an American American silver perch, right? I would assume so, but the colors are a little bit odd. It has some yellow to it, it has those markings here, you know? I don't know. Well, we already got photos of this fish. So I just gotta let it go. No canines, right? Yeah, no canines. All right, bye-bye. Oh yeah, fish on. On the bite, son. I felt it, as soon as I felt it, I put it up. It's a blue striped grunt. Check that out, huh? Is this the first one for the night? I don't even remember, but it is a beautiful blue striped grunt. <laughs> I love how these grunts make these noises, you know, like grr, 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 grr. you know, don't worry little fella, you're going you're going back home, alright? You can go back home and grow a little bit bigger. Damn son. Oh this fish they pull hard sometimes. Oh yeah. Damn man, I felt it and I was like, whoa, another one of these, what? And I mean, it is not that small either, you know, what, what is this thing here? Oh my God, look at this, man, what is this thing, man? Pretty aggressive too, you know, whatever it is, there's a school of it down there. Damn, if only you had canines, man. Let me see, why don't you have canines, man? If only you had canines. Here, 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 go back, go back, here. Oh yeah, come up here. Damn, that was a nice bite. What is this? What the heck? By far the biggest grunt of the night at least. It is a white grunt, all right? This is a big white grunt. This is one of the biggest white grunt I ever caught here. I mean, I'm, I don't know how big this white grunt they really grow to but yeah this is this is a decent this is a decent size night grunt i gotta tell you i gotta tell that much right so let me take a photo of this one at least all right took a few nice photos of this nice white grunt probably the biggest one that i've caught so far up to date easy fish i'm gonna release you soon okay just take it easy nice 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 beautiful well it's gone, but it was a nice, beautiful white grunge, indeed. Oh yeah, come here. Light bite, but a damn son. This is this is when you know they're down there. <laughs> okay, this is when you truly know they are down there, right? This is a Tom Tate right here. And this is a little French grunt. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. This is like a grunt fiesta down there. Go back, man. You too. What well, you, you you need to grow even bigger. Whew. Folks, it is currently 1 a.m. And I gotta tell you something. I'm tired. <laughs> I don't know if you guys noticed in this video or not, I try my best to muster my strength, you know, and bring you guys an enjoyable video, you know, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it, you know, I am pretty tired. I slept only three and a half hours last night, it's 1am right now, I gotta sleep like maybe four hours tonight, wake up tomorrow, try to do some fishing early, sneak out a little bit more, you know. But anyways, right, tonight's statistics, um, we caught a lot of species tonight, you know, that we caught yesterday, right? But I just, I can't feel sad about it because on the other hand, we also caught a lot of species that we did not catch yesterday, right? I mean, I, I already had those species on, on my species list. I'm talking about the pork fish, the hound fish, 
right what else did we catch that wasn't there yesterday well you get the idea right and there's the mysterious perch I, I don't even know if that's a perch or not but there's a mysterious fish that I'm going to identify later right it was a productive night I can't complain you know it is it's still quite windy so not that easy to fish you know so catching all these little species you know of fish you know I mean you can't be you can't be unhappy with it you know anyways it is time for me to unpack go home get to bed man i'm ready to sleep until whatever you know so folks thank you very much for watching today's video hopefully tomorrow i'll bring you like a daytime video if possible okay tie lines and until next time so today we're going to do something extremely risky let's put it that way you know this video is either going to be a huge success or a big failure i mean we are talking about doing an mtb pro box unboxing plus slam in 35 degrees fahrenheit temperatures right this is like ice fishing without safe ice right that's how cold this water is but